Maxine Klebengades, who was best known for her roles in Prisoner and Neighbors, has died suddenly at the age of 58. The much-loved Australian actress died yesterday, the Prisoner fan club Partners in Crime has confirmed in a Facebook announcement. The star played teenage punk Bobby Mitchell on the popular show from 1983 to 1985. We regrettably announced that actress Maxine Klebengates has passed away, the post read. Maxine played the much-loved character of Bobby Mitchell in Prisoner, Terry Inglis in Neighbours, and many other roles on Australian TV. Maxine was only 58. We send our sincere condolences to her son Zane and Maxine's family and friends. R.I.P. Maxine. The fan club owner went on to clarify that the post was not a hoax, as the actress' sudden and unexpected death had been sadly confirmed by a friend. Just to clarify for those inboxing me, the sad news is not a hoax, the post continued. Don't miss! Coronation Street actor bids final farewell to ITV soap, Insight. Prince Edward rushed to the aid of Bedrid Mulrika Yonso, latest, TV star Martin Roberts says life isn't perfect in sad health update, news, a very close friend of Maxine's called me late today, wrote the admin, known as Maria. They, asked me to post the sad news so that Maxine's fans would know. Maxine had many fans. Regards, Maria. As well as her role in Prisoner, Maxine also starred as apprentice plumber Terry Inglis on Neighbours for six months in 1985. Her show run ended when her character Terry died by suicide, which was shocking first for Ramsey Street. Before then, Terry's storyline in the mid-1980s saw her marry TV villain Paul Robinson, Stefan Dennis, Maxine appeared in several other Aussie TV shows throughout the 1990s and 2000s, including The Flying Doctors, Home and Away and All Together Now. Her last public appearance was in Melbourne in 2019, when she reunited with her prisoner castmates for a special reunion. The beloved star married television director Andrew Friedman in 1987 and, according to TV Tonight, is survived by her son Zane, 